Hey you guys, Antrim here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today I'm going to be showing you guys a little creation that I found on Reddit actually called Cuban. And basically what this is, is well, as you guys can see in front of me, there's a whole bunch of little buttons that are all around here. And what these buttons do is they generate the room in front of you here. And funny enough, this is something that would be very, very easy to have done on the new snapshot, but it was built before the new snapshot came out. Thus before the copy and paste commands and all that stuff that came in so this is all done with the individual command block placement at least I'm pretty sure that it is and if you guys want to download this for yourselves the link is going to be in the description below it was made by reddit username sharp tapas kraken so yeah anyways so as you guys can see here as I said before there's a whole bunch of buttons in front of me so if I go ahead and some of these when you highlight over actually it says the name of what it is um, but I think it's like just these bottom ones not too sure um, but anyways so like there's this grass one here so for example if I wanted to start survival that might be the one that I might want to start on and boom it just it starts right there get you know you get yourself a tree and whatnot and boom you can punch it down and uh, one thing that I'm actually kind of curious about is uh, okay wait is Oh, the drops are turned off. That's kind of weird. Piggy, why did Piggy, why, why you do this? Why you do this? Okay, let's actually try and rebuild it up and let's see what I, Oh, God. Okay, I just destroyed it right away. So, yeah, it does actually reset the world itself if, uh, you know, you, you wind up destroying it. So, anyways, let's go and let's take a look at some of these other ones here. Because I, I guess if you want to play a, you know, quick game of spleef with your friends or something, it actually does give you a diamond shovel and boom. Yeah, you can you can actually play, like, spleef with your friends and whatnot. Um, if you decide to play this with them, I guess, um, I'm just going to go, I'm, I'm just going to jump in. Because my, my health is not doing too well anyway, so I figured, why not? And then if you want to wipe the world clean, then you can just go ahead and you can do that. And boom, you get yourself started on a blank slate world but don't build your world inside there unless you are not planning on resetting your area let's go and let's check this one out here because this this one looks dangerous okay ooh, this looks awesome except i think by default yeah this world was actually listed on peaceful mode so this wouldn't help is are those regular yeah those are just regular spiders so still something very kind of interesting let's go and let's check out the horse one here because it's a horse world and wow Wow, okay, yeah, the, the, that glitch needs to get fixed, this Minecraft glitch, it seriously needs to get fixed, because it will last forever, like, those are now there forever, alright, let's go ahead and let's check out this area, because why not, you know, it's, it's, it's an area to check out. <laughs> Yeah, alright, but yeah, anyways guys, yeah, if you guys want to download it, I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to go through these now, because why not? I mean, it, it's interesting nonetheless, so I just wanted to check all these out. Okay, in this one you just get a, oh god, I thought I was getting just a straight lava world for a second. I wonder if there's like treasure inside of any of these worlds or anything like that. I do like the way that he sort of faked a nether portal here, along with the one block that's like always missing on the corner because you don't really need it. Alright, let's go and let's check out this one here, because why not? Yeah. All right, this thing's pretty awesome. Uh, what I'm gonna do at the end of the video as well is I'm gonna like punch my way out of this and see what see what you know what's going on with the redstone because uh, it does seem like it's actually very very intricate. And I would imagine there's like miles of redstone, so I just kind of want to check that out. So it looks like we have ourselves a mesa biome with lava right there. Uh, makes it feel like more of like a medium-ish hell world, but I don't think so. All right, let's check out this one. It's likely gonna be the end. I'm guessing. Oh God. Okay, well, let's go and let's climb up this little thing. Oh, it's the actual end, except, except, okay, wait, how do I, how do, how do I turn it on? How do I turn this on? Like, this is, this is kind of weird. What they should do is they should make one missing so that you can actually fill the thing in and it works. But, uh, okay, anyways, I think that one might actually, this one might actually be the straight survival one because of the pickaxe. I'm not really too sure. Um, yeah, this is the one that you can actually play survival in. Alright, let's go and let's see if I can actually break apart this wood here. Um, not too sure. Yeah, okay, so this actually updates the game mode. So, that's cool. So, the one before didn't update the game mode. I knew that there was something weird with that. Like, the other ones were kind of just for aesthetic reasons. Not too sure why. And, again, I hate that those things are just there by default. But, yeah, you could actually play survival in this. And then, boom, you need more wood. You need more wood. Oh, you just hit the button again. Bam, you get yourself more wood. Alright, cool. Go and let's keep doing this. <laughs> this was actually the one that I was looking for because it, it was shown in a screenshot and I didn't want to not show off that one. Alright, let's see. Is this one going to be a little house that we can live in by default? I think maybe. Uh, one idea that I did actually have for this was that instead of, be, because of the most recent snapshot or the snapshot before that where you can do smooth teleporting, I think it would be wiser to have all of these different rooms 
like that room and then this room that I'm standing in all built as separate rooms and you get teleported between them. That way you don't have to worry about your rooms getting erased. You just get te teleported from room to room or uh, obviously using the copy paste commands would be cool. Ooh, diamond shrivels. Yay. Yay. And then I guess if I wanted to enchant something here, I could go ahead and I could do that. But I don't have any levels on me whatsoever. Actually, let's go and let's punch these out and see if this chest has anything like secretive in it. You know, I'm just I'm just kind of curious. All right, let's see here. Nope, nothing. Uh, okay, there's nothing in that one either. Furnace. I, I thought there was something in that furnace for a second because of the fire in front of it. So yay for Minecraft for fooling me. Awesome. All right, let's go and let's check out this one now. Let's let's see if this is just looks like a zombie dungeon of sorts. Oh god. Okay, yeah, there were supposed to be zombies spawning there, but it, it didn't actually work. Um, yeah. <laughs> This game, man. This game. All right, I'm gonna check out one more, and then we're gonna go ahead and we are going to check out the outside, and then we'll end off the video there. So let's go ahead and let's check this out here. Bam. Okay, yeah. So this looks like straight up, you know, zombie. Well, I mean, a dungeon of sorts. Let's go and let's check out the inside here if we can. Actually, now is when I'm gonna game my game mode myself to creative, just so I can take a quick look under here, just to see if there's anything actually here. Does not look like it. All right, let's go and let's break our way out of here. And let's, whoo, okay. So this actually makes a lot of sense. You know, it's not towers and towers of redstone, but it is a fair amount of redstone. So obviously I don't understand by default, you know, what all of this does. Um, looks like this may be the clearing one. Okay, replace, replace. Yeah, it's replacing them all with zero, I think. So this might be the air replacing one. Uh, that's That sets a redstone block, sets a redstone block. Looks like these all set replace blocks. So that that's kind of cool. Uh, yeah, those all replace with air. Uh, this one seems like also, oh, okay, this one's like a maze of sorts, so it looks like he classifies all of them. Okay, this one does the nether fortress, so I'm curious what this tall stack of them does. Uh, let's see here, like, let's see, it, well, it sets a block at negative, yeah, okay, so, sets a block to zero, sets negative 11 to zero, no, 14. Okay, so it looks like this is the tower that sets all of the various ones to zero, and it looks like some of these also do the, uh, the landscape. So, yeah, you can see, it looks like he, 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 like, made sure that people were gonna check this out. So, that's kind of interesting. So, yeah, you can see all the various different layers here of things that were going on. So, that one sets, you know, sets the whole thing to lava, it looks like, um, based on one of the worlds. So, I guess if, uh, it's needed, then, you know, it uses that. That's kind of cool. All right, what's going on? Why, whoa, why, why is this horse out here? Why, why is the, why is this horse here? I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so the redstone isn't really all that complicated at all, it seems like. I mean, yes, it is complex, but it's not like, it doesn't go out for, like, miles or anything. And that just is really a testament to show how far, you know, redstone has come. Like, imagine how difficult this would be building something like this with Traslander's old glitch way back, you know, back in the day when it was first discovered. Um, where blocks would replace themselves, except it had to be done in the glitchy fashion, or even prior to that, like, just imagine how difficult or impossible things like this would be. You'd have to use, like, pistons and stuff like that way back in the day, but not anymore. <laughs> and then this is the reset switch. These are zombie switch, tree switches... So yeah, very, very interesting. So I hope you all have enjoyed this. Again, if you guys want to check it out, the Reddit thread is going to be in the description. Uh, I found the link for it in the Imgur post that was made thereafter. Well, not thereafter, but uh, when you click on the image, it shows the Imgur post, and that shows the download link. So I hope you all have enjoyed. I hope you all check it out, and maybe, you know, you guys find some entertainment with this. Yeah, I hope you all have enjoyed. My name is Ant Venom, and I bid you all farewell. Thanks so much for watching.